Hello, and welcome to week one of the 2014 National Football League Football Prediction Center of the Jabernator, brought to you by Smith & Forge Hard Cider. That's right, Smith & Forge. If you get beer and you start drinking it, you get fat. If you drink hard cider, you get hard. Oh, 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 oh. I mean, you know, like hard muscles, right? <laughs> Don't take me the wrong way. I only put one on Seattle. Sunday at noon, we have Atlanta at uh, New Orleans. Where are they playing? In Atlanta. Therefore, I will pick Atlanta for a huge upset at noon over the Saints. Atlanta, I put two on it. Chicago over Buffalo. That's right, my Chicago Bears are going to beat Buffalo. And I put 16 on the Bears. 16. Kansas City is going to beat Tennessee. Six on the Chiefs at home over Tennessee. I've got eight. <laughs> My voice cracked because I don't know if I really believe this. I've got eight on the Minnesota Vikings beating St. Louis in St. Louis. Eight on the Vikings, if you can believe that. Uh, New England, New England, New England, over Miami, in Miami, 13 on the Patriots. Okay, uh, New York Jets at home against Oakland, put four on the New York Jets. Philadelphia at home against Jacksonville. Total mismatch. LaShawn, Shady McCoy. Great running back. I think he's going to be the number one back this year. Shady McCoy. LaShawn McCoy of the Eagles. They're going to beat Jacksonville. Um, 14, however, on the Eagles this week. 14 on the Eagles. Uh, Pittsburgh, five confidence pool points over Cleveland. Baltimore is going to be Cincinnati. Um, seven on the Ravens. Washington is going to go into Houston and beat the Houston Texans. Um, only three on Washington. I'm not overly confident. However, San Francisco's defense, I don't know. This is going to be a close game. I'm going to say San Francisco is going to win by two or three points. It's going to be a high-scoring game. And... 12 on the 49ers. I think they're going to win. Not by much. Tampa Bay over Carolina. In Tampa Bay, that's an upset. One of my two upsets. The other one being Atlanta over New Orleans. Uh, Tampa Bay, I'm going to put 9 on Lovey Smith and Josh McCown. Former Bears. The Tampa Bay Buccaneers at home. Um, I like uh, Josh McCown. Great guy. Phenomenal season for the Bears last year. I think he had 12, maybe even 13 touchdown passes. I think it was 12. Uh, one interception. Better numbers than Cutler. And they just let McCown go. 
I don't know why. I really don't know why. Um, so I think Josh McCown is going to do good for Tampa and win that game. I'm going to put nine on Tampa. It's an upset over Carolina. Next up, Denver over Indianapolis. I guess Denver is going to get some revenge over the uh, Colts who beat them last year. Uh, Denver uh, at home, 11 on the Denver Broncos. Uh, Detroit, New York Giants, Monday Night Football. I'm going to pick the Lions. I'm going to give them 15. They always start the season really hot. Um, 15 on the Detroit Lions. And in the nightcap Monday night game, there's two Monday night games. One earlier one. The second later one is in Arizona. I'm going to pick them only because they're the home team. I don't know how good Arizona is. I don't know how good San Diego is. It's hard to pick. I don't know these teams that well. I'm going to give Arizona 10 points just because they're at home. And they did really well last year. They didn't make the playoffs, but I think they won 10 games. Um, Arizona. Okay. A couple of questions for this pool that I'm in. Um, final score of the Monday Night Football games. Detroit 34, New York Giants 13. Game 2, Arizona 31, San Diego 21. Tiebreaker number two. Uh, who's going to score the most points this week? Philadelphia Eagles, man. So, the fewest points in the NFL this week, I don't know. Tennessee Titans, just the guess.